Did you know that psychotherapy, as we know it today, has its roots in the 19th century? Before that time, mental illnesses were often treated with ineffective and inhumane methods, such as bloodletting, purging, and even exorcism. However, the 19th century saw a shift in understanding and treating mental health, thanks to the pioneering work of several influential figures. One such figure was Philippe Pinel, a French physician who revolutionized the treatment of mentally ill patients by introducing more humane approaches. In 1793, he began removing patients' chains and advocated for a more compassionate and understanding approach, which became known as moral treatment. This method emphasized kindness, respect, and empathy, focusing on individualized care and the role of the environment in mental health. Pinel's work set the stage for a new era in mental health care, as it shifted the focus from punishment and confinement to understanding and support. Around the same time, another key figure in the history of psychotherapy emerged Benjamin Rush, an American physician who is often considered the father of American psychiatry. Rush also promoted moral treatment, as well as advocating for the establishment of specialized mental health institutions. He believed in the importance of cleanliness, proper nutrition, exercise, and social interaction in the treatment of mental disorders. Another significant figure in the history of psychotherapy was Sigmund Freud, the founder of psychoanalysis. Born in 1856, Freud believed that mental illnesses stemmed from unconscious conflicts and repressed memories. He developed techniques like free association, dream analysis, and transference to explore patients' unconscious thoughts allowing them to confront and resolve their psychological issues. Although some of Freud's theories and methods have been controversial, his work laid the foundation for many modern psychotherapy approaches. During the same period, the American psychologist William James made significant contributions to the field of psychology. He published the groundbreaking work The Principles of Psychology in 1890, in which he explored various aspects of human thought and behavior. James advocated for the use of introspection, self-examination, and personal experience as tools for understanding the human mind. His work paved the way for the development of various therapeutic approaches, such as cognitive behavioral therapy CBD and humanistic therapy. The 19th century also saw the emergence of the talking cure, a term coined by one of Freud's patients, and lo, this approach, which involved patients discussing their thoughts and emotions with a therapist, marked a significant departure from previous treatments that often relied on physical interventions. The talking cure laid the groundwork for modern talk therapy and remains a cornerstone of many psychotherapeutic approaches today. As the 19th century drew to a close, new ideas about the nature of mental illness continued to emerge. Emil Krapelin, a German psychiatrist, developed a classification system for mental disorders that would eventually evolve into the modern diagnostic criteria used by mental health professionals. Additionally, the work of Swiss psychiatrist Carl Jung expanded on Freud's ideas, introducing concepts like the collective unconscious and the process of individuity in. The 19th century was a time of tremendous change in our understanding and treatment of mental health issues. Pioneers like Pinnell, Freud, and James, along with many others, laid the groundwork for the diverse range of psychotherapeutic approaches available today. Their innovative ideas and commitment to improving the lives of mentally ill patients have left a lasting impact on the field of mental health care.